hi welcome back to my channel it's me mariam kapama thank you very much for coming back and i miss you guys it has been a while since you know i've been doing a video face to face like this but i've been doing voiceovers and i kind of miss you so i decided to pop up just to say hello and if you're new here by the way i so much appreciate you for tuning in and please go ahead and subscribe like this video comment down below and today i'm here to show you first of all i'm going to be doing hot oil treatment but i have rice water with me so i want to show you how i do my hot oil treatment but using potent diys okay so if you're my regular degla return supporter you already know i once did a neem times cbd oil and this one couple months ago around nine months nine ten months ago and today i just trained it and put it to my applicator bottle so this is the oil i'll be using to make the hot oil treatment cbd is amazing and by the way if you're new here don't feel like you left you're left out i have a video here on my channel and i'm going to link it up in the cards and down in the description box so we're good because i got you since i'm your auntie you know what i'm saying <laughs> so today we're going to be using this to hot oil treatment but before we start this rice water ain't your day your regular degla rice water this is rice water pro box rice water point point two point one oh <laughs> point whatever <laughs> but what i'm saying is this is way more potent than your regular rice water because of the cactus in here the cactus adds sleep into your rice water so the rice water will you'll be able to you know come through the tango using the water itself so this is what we'll be using to saturate our hair before we go in with the oil because we're dealing with saturated hair and this is what you're going to make so before we go on straining this one let's go make this one first and let it ferment for 24 hours then yeah so before i confuse you all you might be asking why am i using why, why should i use rice water or why should i use you say it's hot oil treatment guys this this rice water has so much so much benefits to your hair than using just regular water so if you have an opportunity to deal with your hair just go in with rice water rinse hair tea rinse all these rinses are amazing than using regular water you can even go in with floral water just go in with something that is potent to support your hair you know your hair needs this stuff and if you have access that you can provide then go ahead and do so so just a disclaimer for people who are maybe confused asking this and that so we're using overnight rice water guys okay overnight rice water for the win
press it you guys this you can still use it just adding more water let it ferment and you can use it as a as something else you know you can make another batch out of this or you can let it ferment longer you know still works So we are going in with the water first so that the hair gets saturated and this rice water normally it's it tends to soften the hair so we go in with the water the goal is to hydrate and to get all the benefits from the rice water and of course there are millions of benefits when it comes to using rice water in case you didn't know but if you know then you know rice water is the jam so washing the hair with this then going in with the CBD times neem hair growth oil you can make your own or you can have the oil that you already have because I have a bunch of DIYs you know I'll leave a whole playlist down in the description box let's go This is what I have after a couple rounds. The hair is saturated and hydrated, so it's time. So the benefits of using cactus in the rice water, you see when you finger detangle, there is still slime going on there. So you don't just rip your hair with your fingers during the process. So it's time for the CBD oil guys Now that there's a bunch of oil in my hair, I'm just going in. Just a type of an updo to help, you know, the process. Going in with the shell kit. And listen, we don't end here. It's important that you go in with heat. Put heat of any type, whether it's a steaming cap, sit on a hooded dryer, just go ahead and put heat. Heat is very important, you are not going to compromise on the process because once you put heat, that's the whole point of hot oil treatment because I didn't warm the oil, I didn't warm the water, so it's very important to use heat. When you use heat, you change the temperature of the liquid and the oils that you have put on your hair, so it helps a lot with hair cuticles to open up and to soak all the good stuff. So make sure you use heat and sit under heat for at least 30 to 40 minutes just let it let the let it marinate what can i say let it marinate let it do it thing and i'm going to see you guys after 40 minutes for the reveal see you later that day
It's super soft. This is how it looks and feels. Now let me go wash it then let me go wash it first. So this is the end result when the hair is all washed with products and that's that's everything. I'll see you guys in the video on the screen and until next time be sure to follow me on all my social media accounts they will be down in the description box and of course if you haven't subscribed be sure to subscribe and like comment and share to your loved one and until next time I'm gonna see you guys in my next video bye